Hey guys, and today I am going to be reacting to a Breaking Bad scene of the second to last episode of the final season, so I'm just going to jump right ahead and get involved. Andrew Ross Sorkin of the New York Times wrote a column suggesting that the grant was a kind of publicity maneuver to shore up the stock price of gray matter technologies because of your association with Walter White. Well, that's not exactly the way. To clench way. yourself, so to speak, of having a methamphetamine kingpin as co-founder of your company. Charlie, I'm glad you brought that up. I have to believe that the, the investing public understands we're talking about a person who, who was there early on, but who had virtually nothing to do with the creation of the company and still less to do with growing it into what it is today. So what was Walter White's contribution? You know, to be honest, uh, honey... The company name. The company name. We, we came up with it by combining our names. Uh, Schwartz means black, black plus white makes gray. It's gray matter technologies. Exactly. As far as I can recall, his contribution begins and ends right there. There are oh, continuous reports of blue methamphetamine considered his signature product throughout the Southwest and some evidence of reaching as far as Europe. So my question is, is Walter White still out there? No, he's not. You sound very sure. I am. Oh, I, I can't speak to this Heisenberg that, that, that people refer to. But whatever, whatever he became, the, the sweet, kind, brilliant man that we once knew long ago, he's gone. Walter White's dead, but Heisenberg, he's not dead. But to be absolutely clear, he's going back. He's going to go back. Well, I know I've seen him. He's going back. 